Okay, I forgot how this works. Okay, volume all the way up, there we go. Man, every single thing has a different volume setting. Okay, so... J, K, L. Shift. Uh... I remember absolutely nothing, so I'm just gonna go through all the dungeons until I find something. Oh, hi. In a graveyard? I see no shame. A grave robber is among us. Worse than that, a flower killer. I need to take a break. Almost lost my composure. <sighs> Leave me to pray in peace. I keep thinking about what Keaton said. I shouldn't stay upset at the past, but sometimes it's not as easy as just forgetting. Life ain't always that cut and dry. Am I making sense? I don't know if I should feel sorry for you. Understanding that? I thought you left for good that time, after Pa died. You'd think I'd be happy, right? But deep down, I was sad. I started believing you changed, and then you were go gone again. But I couldn't blame you for leaving this time. Sometimes I wish I'd done the same. I kept thinking, had we realized. Do you think we could have saved him? Makes me sad to think about. Just hope he's with your parents. Warren, what you did wasn't right. But there's still that part of me. The one that thinks you've changed. Look, it's not my place to forgive you. That's between you and your parents. Those the things I said to you. I could have said them better. I'm sorry for that. Your pa was a good man. I miss him all the time. Now I've got to get out of the habit of catching extra fish. All right, so I can't give you the beetle. Okay, yeah. I remember that I had not actually done anything for fixing that. Oh, nice. In honor of all those who gave their lives and stood against the god of hate. Ow. Also, ow. Oh, right. Ah, dang it. Stop holding down the run button, I guess. Well, that happened. Maybe paint the sunrise? morning view. Okay, yeah, there's definitely two statues and I only found the one. Hey. Ugh, I couldn't sleep at all.
Okay, all the buffs are reset, so I definitely want to go and buy more buffs. Down there. Okay. Uh, da da da. Great improvement. Luck potion? Yes. When I came to this town, the culture, it was unlike anything I was used to. So I spent every day in the library, learning about your people. Romance, Orin, I value you greatly. When I see you, my stomach turns to knots. Your efforts, they make my feelings toward you grow. Do you understand what I'm saying? It is hard for me to, more, to be more blatant than this. My feelings, I'm still beginning to understand them. There's a part of me that longs to believe you may be feeling the same. However, it is not the time for that. I simply wanted to make my feelings known to you. I always have enjoyed creating new poisons. It's a, it is a perfect science. It allows even me to lift very heavy objects, double your strength, grateful for your patronage, and no falling damage. Welcome to Reds. Man, I can't believe you're finally back home. I hear the girls down south are quite as cute. You find anything you, anyone you like down there? Don't worry, Orin. You can fall in love with me if you want. I don't think you and I would be such a bad combo. Me, having fun and getting into trouble. You, rescuing me from whatever situation I'm in. I mean, opposites attract, right? Makes your heart beat a little faster, huh? You're cute, Orin. I'm starting to think you have a crush on me. Okay, well, I'm trying to buy food, thank you. Uh, da -da -da. this one, special move. Ignore knockout. Nah, okay. What was this one? Moving. Nope, I've already got that. Smoke salmon. Extra vitality. Is that a lost recipe? Here, I'll trade you what you were getting for it. Thank you. Let me know if you need anything else. Nope, not there. Oh, nice. The rock stayed destroyed. What about this way? That works. Ah, dang. Hmm. That didn't work either.
Curse the bones. I should get these to a priest. Hmm. Oh, I want to move the barrels there. Okay. Fragment of heart ore. Only one more fragment to go. Okay, so you can punch the walls too, and they disappear. Okay, not that way. Not that way. Just money. Dang it. What? Where's the other thing? the other statue. I guess I better go to the priest.
All right, it's down there. Wait, what? Where's this from? Colorless Void. A fragment of Heart Ore. Now my vitality will be increased. Hello there, handsome. Thought I'd seen the last of you. Thank you for killing me, by the way. Finally freed from that dreadful crocodile. Oh, you don't know, do you? We can't die. If we do, we just get sent back to this colorless void. It's a shame, really. Ah, but at least I got some color while I was out. Now you can appreciate me even more, hmm? Don't think I can't see you staring at me. Ah, I'd like to show you how appreciative I am, really. But how am I sp But how should I tell the other- But I should tell the others not to kill you first. They aren't the biggest fans of humans. I think some of them forgot men can't be mages. Oh, and oh, how they hate mages. But can you blame them? Oh, well. Oh, well, I should head back to work. You come see me, okay? I'd still like to repay you. Let your imagination wander on how. Hello, I'm Tedra, and I'm going to be the best chef in this colorless pit. If I just had a secret weapon, I could beat her. I could be the best. Help me, won't you? Find me a secret weapon. I'm not drinking that. I don't like the way black smoke is roiling in this pot. This light is strangely calming. Oddly beautiful. It's full of... I'm not sure. I wonder who she is. There's a bottle beside it. Human, what do you want? I need something to hit a target from afar. Like a bow or something. Then I don't have to wait. All kinds of spices, I think. It's full of clothes. This isn't my bed. This doesn't look like it's been used or cleaned in ages. This is not fresh water. This isn't my bed. It smells like sweat. This is the only thing in here that's not damaged. This thing is deceptively heavy. What a strange array of crystal weapons. Who could hope to lift this? Whoa, what kind of monster are you? I'm just messing with you. Hey, human. Call my father. I'm fading. I think he's in your world, actually. Traded some colors for power and bailed. Anyways, help. Starving girl here. No sweets, though. I'm watching my figure. <laughs> Sitting in the bench. Ooh, hey, hard ore. Only three more to go. His water looks so dead somehow. Well, hello there. What a cute little human. My luster will be ruined. I need my soap, but my, usually, but my usual supplier ran out. Don't worry. He was punished. This light is strangely calming. This isn't my bed. I wonder who she is. Okay. A human? As long as you aren't a mage. I ran out of yarn. I was almost done, too. Whoa, another human. You're pretty scrawny, though. I need something with a bit more zing. You have any ideas? Whoa, that really hits the spot. What is this? Coffee? Hey, cowboy, start serving this. I don't even know what it is. Honestly, didn't think you'd find something. I don't really have anything to give as thanks. Give me a sec. 
Here, use this. You can't just steal one of my tablecloths. Tablecloths? No, this is a tattered cape of a long dead hero. Trust me. Tattered cape? Possibly. Anyway, my near. You ready for more workouts? Cowboy still hasn't stocked up on that drink you brought. I'll make it worth your while for more. Or I could just raid your world for it. Oh, then maybe I can see him again. I ran out of yarn. Okay, so what's her name's father? Stole some color, ran away. The Oni uh, wants to see him again. I've got a tattered cape. Hail and well met, human traveler. You aren't a mage, are you? I'm in dire need of an accessory. Surely you have something that will solve my issue, traveler. Behold, traveler, the lost cape of Ithrizar. Surely you did not know the true value. How else could you willingly part with it? I must think of something equal in value. Otherwise, such a trade would wound mine honor. Ah, I know. I have it right here. Behold, noble wanderer. The endless ball of Githis. Is this a ball of flame yard? Yep. Thank you. I will wear this incredible artifact with pride. She's going to take my head. Again. Do you know what that is like? Oh, right. Humans can't remove their heads without perishing. Uh, where was the bar? Here it is. You have any yarn? I ran out. This will be great. I can finally finish knitting my horn warmers. I ordered too much old natural slime soap. Here, take it. It's great for your skin. Slime soap? I probably shouldn't think about it. Huh. Did I have 666 coins coming in here, or... I'm not, not, I'm not gonna think about it. Whoop, what? Huh. I swear I hit the space bar, not the K key. Fragment of hard ore, one more to go. What, no, no, wait, it's okay. You aren't a mage, I'm Berg. Hello. Is that tea? Smells wonderful. This wood is so crumbly and brittle. I sleep so restlessly at night. So many nightmares. Think you could find me something to help me sleep? You hear distant barking. I suspect that the castle is where plot starts, so not going there. Ah, hello. Well, well. Look who it is. We never properly met. I'm Ren. I need something with some flair. Something to catch a certain someone's eye. You look pretty full, don't tell me. Are you a glutton? Gross. Okay, so those are more buffs. And since I can only hold four, I'm gonna have to figure out something else. You wouldn't happen to have any skincare product, would you? Oh, this will be splendid. You see, my usual supplier said he was bought out of stock. This whole ordeal has been so stressful. What do humans like? I'm sure I ate something you may appreciate. Oh, I know just the thing. A serpent's bracelet. This actually looks valuable. This is going to look great on me, don't you think? Good, good. I was worried you were blind with how much time you gave those human girls. As for your reward, I just came up with a new recipe. This is not just any old carrot cake. This is the carrot cake. The carrot cake. I'm told it doesn't get better than this. All right, and then chef over here wanted a secret recipe or a secret weapon, not you. You wanted a bow.
There you are. Okay, guess not. I thought you were a chef. Hmm. Now who wants the carrot cake? You got the cape. Okay, I guess I did accidentally hit K. Dimensional tearing? What's that? Another one may of your kind. You reek of dirt. Most unpleasant. My name is Duke Kralion of the illustrious Order of the Librum. Charmed. To be quite honest, you are a bit of a blur. I fear I need something to aid with my sight. Otherwise, I shall be unable to read again. Oh, the horror. Mother, help me. What? You don't want carrots to help your eyesight? I have no idea what any of these notes say. All kinds of books. I can't read half the titles. More books. Wait, Mage Hunting 101? What's a mage? Dealing with the loss of a parent. It seems out of place. He's growing a flower. Doesn't seem the type. There's nothing written on it. Strange. Hmm. Oh, wait. She said she specifically didn't want sweets, so I should probably try and give her the carrot cake. I'm fading. I think he's in your world, actually. Trades some colors for power unveiled. Anyways, help, starving girl here. No sweets, though. I'm watching my figure. Dang. Alright, might as well try the castle then. Time out. Okay, nope, this is definitely a dungeon. Perhaps you would like a carrot cake? I think something that's just my foot. Alright, so you don't want the carrot cake. What was dear to us was taken. Taken by those of power. You should work with us. We will get revenge together. Do I have to be at a certain time for them to want stuff? I like your eyes. They hide a hate like mine. Huh. Maybe having the cursed bones is what unlocked this. Because it said, uh in memory of the ser ones who fought the servants of he hate. You can always count on them being cute little knights, never mages. You aren't here to flirt, are you? Am I allowed to keep a human? Oh, my father, he's in your world, traded some colors for power and veiled. Anyways, help starving girl here, no sweets though, watching my figure. Okay. So definitely can't give you the carrot cake. I did get the coffee in the regular world though. I might have to trade with someone 
over there. What? I hear there aren't mages where you come from. Good. That kind of trash should be purged. That, take note, human. Mages are evil and must be eradicated. For the good of all. No, you may mo certainly not touch my library. Mother said your kind can't even read. Hmm. Could also be in the dungeon, because there was that one time there was a bunny in the dungeon. And there might be a key to get into that house. Oh, hi. Come to avenge what you've lost. How delightful. I suppose I can help you, but I don't do handouts. Consider it a fair trade. You collect two enthralling colors for me, and I might just allow you to earn my favor. Perhaps the color of a broken and twisted soul first. In a world such as you, I'm sure there are plenty of twisted souls to be taken. But find out who will give it willingly. I wonder if he's still in his castle. I'll be watching. I can feel the heat of its furious colors. You brought that fury heart for me, yes? The heart, the furious embers of a dying civilization, valiantly striving against the inevitable. If we wait a bit longer, there will be new colors born there. You want to know why you're here? How cute. You see, this colorless prison was not ours to begin with, and we wish to go home. That portal is just one of many that reach into countless worlds and worked, worked out well for you, I suppose. Before you left, your parents were teaching me to be a guide, how to be the best, and I was. When your parents died, I took over. It felt like the right thing to do. I was so full of myself. Then a few families came to me, asking if I could take them through an impossible expedition. And I thought I could handle it, but what I was too stupid to realize is I'm just one person. Your parents could have done it, but not me. When it happened, I didn't even see it. Couldn't even look up. I failed them all. Mothers, fathers, children. They died because I was a coward. Crawled up on the ground. They bled out and I couldn't even look at them. Now, I don't do much. Can't bring myself to go into the frontier again. Until they rest in peace. I'm never going back. Your father was a good man. I miss him all the time. Now I've got to get out of the habit of catching extra fish. Alright, not that way. I forgot how I get out of here. Seeing me like this makes me feel a little off guard. Growing up, Father Xavier always asked me to help around the church, so I'd run and hide down here. Now that I think about it, I kind of feel bad. I mean, he took me in like his own daughter. I was just never made for their church life. Can you imagine me being all holy? I mean, you found me in a jail cell. When we were younger, Reverend and I used to terrorize the town. We got used to getting what we wanted, regardless of how. Do you think less of me because I do that stuff still? I knew you were smart. I mean, it's made me become pretty good friends with you, so I guess there's a positive, but River and I aren't close anymore. She says there's a part of her that misses the old me, the one who used to run around and play in the mud. I understand that. There's a part of me that misses that too, but at the same time, I wouldn't give my confidence up for anything. Boo, I should probably be heading back to work 
before Keaton bites my head off. See you soon, handsome. Not interested. If you're looking for answers, I'm sure there's much to be learned from the library's worth of journals penned by Oswin Van. The sheriff and his grandfather were such great men. You can probably find most of his writings in Castle Vaughn. Hello, hero. Do you have any coffee for me? No? Oh, um, that's okay. I'm just running out. It's been difficult. I've had to start rationing. Down to only four cups a day. Okay, five. But it's still a struggle. I know I should be better about it, but being an adult is hard. Might be responsible when I can just... Huh? What are we talking about? Coffee? Did you bring some? No? Oh, I... Aha, there's the church. My word, Oren. Those are cursed bones. Where in Rame's name did you get those? Give those here. I will bless them so that they can have a proper burial. Go speak to the gravedigger. I will need him to prepare a grave. Okay, that's not it. A grave? Aye, I'll get one ready. Go tell him it'll be ready by morning. Wonderful. Thank you for your help, Oren. I'll feel much better once we have these in the ground. I'm afraid few will be in attendance for the burial for this of this poor soul. Will you join us? Good. Let's put this poor soul to rest. Huh. Huh? What do you mean, huh? What is this? Are those stairs? Looks like it. Well, we can't bury these here. Suppose not. Would you please dig another grave? Hmm. Thank you for coming, Oren. We'll get him buried as soon as we have a proper grave. Be careful of the stairs. There's an accident waiting to happen. Oh, dang. I was trying to talk to you. And they're gone. Alright. Well, might as well go through this dungeon. Hmm. Well, glad that a charge attack will insta-kill those guys. When I'm powered up. Ooh, Lumen Beetle. I have to wait for you. I mean, I could take one damage and not care, but okay. Ah, just cash. Hmm. Okay, I have to stand on the stairs. Cash again. Clearly, I need to go to the casino. Hmm. That was a mistake. Dang it. Got it. Dang it. Hmm.
herb seeds, I guess. Oh, hello. Pretty easy boss, but considering you could do this immediately after uh, getting the lariat, that's fine. First pick. I need to stop picking up strange objects. Be careful who you trust. Okay, so nothing new from you. And there's the church down there. You think she's really listening? Lauren, another cursed item. My, that looks like quite the solid pickaxe. Rame, may your e light burn the evil that taints this tool. Let it be remade clean in your name so that it may act in your service. Luxon. There we are. Give this a swing. Once you're outside. Blessed pickaxe. I best th bet this will do some serious damage. Shall I bless you as well? Holy spines. Perhaps you are cursed as well. Do you accept Rame's light? No. Disappointing choice. It's hard to decide. If the sunset is prettier... Uh, okay. So, here... Have you seen her? Oh, Marina. What a beauty. Mary, what what have you gotten yourself into now? It's just a couple of scratches. is not just... Rame, save me. Mary, you're going to get yourself killed. Please, you worry too much. It's the fourth time I've had to come in this month. You're somehow in worse shape each time I see you. It's really nothing. Then if that's the case, why don't you let me go? What? Let you go where? Fighting with you. I suppose it wouldn't hurt. Have you experienced the real thing? Really? I, I thought you'd never say yes. So you've been, you've been improving a lot. You won't be able to fight the bit. Mary, not right now. Lauren, privacy. Hmm, back for more? You want praise for killing that beast? What are you, a pup? Should I scratch you behind your ears as well? Are you prepared to prove yourself to me? Oh, it costs money. Zoli? He doesn't look human. Don't look so happy. A child could have beaten that. Hmm, you're still so weak. What, do you not believe me? Hey, one day I will knock you down to size. Are you prepared to prove yourself to me? A book stands out. Midnight War. Will you read it? The last war of Esterosa was between life and death itself. This led to the end of the worship of Var, and all practices associated with him. 
The war lasted only three years, with the first two so with the first two saw the servants of Var victorious. The great cataclysm changed the tides of war when the two gods fought alongside their servants. Var was defeated with his servants, and Zoli prospered. Put the book back. Dang it. Well, good thing I got that buff still. Or do I? I do. Aha, there you are. Congratulations, you didn't die. You want to treat pup? You fight recklessly. I've trained children more disciplined than you. What does a pup like you have to prove anyway? Are you prepared to prove yourself to me? Alright, no lore this time. Just a cannon, okay. Maybe all that mining is finally paying off. Good work, kid. I've heard about you before you even came back. They said you stole 400 gold from your parents. Is that true? Hmm. At least you aren't a lying pup. I just hope you repaid what you owed. Are you prepared to prove yourself to me? Marina, your report of Revulan's influence spreading north has caused us great concern. Do what must be done. Revulan must be stopped. Huh. There's some lore. Ow. 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 Dang. Alright, I'm just gonna go to the church then. Or, er, the castle. I think I have like one crest piece left to find. Okay, there's a chest over there. Hmm. Ah, good. He broke it. The savage. Does he truly hate his family so? I'm broken up as a family crest. Please return it to me. Okay, so I guess I am missing another one.
Hmm. That's a lot easier. That might be all of them. Whoops. Nope, it was not. A chest. Dang it. Ugh, fall damage. Got it. Oh, I've already been here. Worthless. All right, I need to go heal. Here. She's probably in the church then. Uh, you look injured. Let me heal you. Thank you. Are you feeling better now? Yes. Thank you. Not right now. Alright, that way is definitely cleared. 
Dang it. Okay, this room's clear. journal. Will you read it? Yes. The blade seems to affect my son very much. I had to remove it, and my studies from the keep. I shall continue my work in the lighthouse. I pray he does not continue to hear its whispers and hauntings. This darkness will die by my hands. Sir Oswin Van. An old journal. This blade is evil. When alone, I can hear its whispers speaking of rebirth and power. And then I saw him, the red swordsman that I killed. He and this blade are some kind of primordial evil. Rame chose me for this task, and it's time it is time I take action. Sir Oswin Van. Someone hit this desk hard. An old journal. Never in all my days serving King Ragnar have I fought such a monster. My comrades were all slaughtered in short order, and I too nearly found myself at the mercy of his blade. His eyes glow like a predator in the night, his face hid beneath the shadow of his thick red hair. I, to this day, know not how I managed to best him. I fear luck was on my side that day. His strange Esterosian blade is mine now. I pray he never returns for it. Those eyes are ones I fear will haunt me for many years. Sir Oswin Van. It's not a very good sketch of a swordsman. No way. Is that Bolivar? An old journal. I have moved my family to the northern frontier. This small port of mine shall be the grave of this accursed blade. With rain by my side, I devote my life to the destruction of this blade and its master. For too long I have prayed to rain for a purpose, a reason to live. This blade seems to be that answer. Sir Oswin Van. Alright, so there's the plot. Okay, yeah, I've been here already. Here as well. Hmm, that didn't help. Oh, wait. Duh, there's an anvil. I should uh, put the pieces together. No? Someone carved the word quest on one. It looks a little bare. I remember these old dishes. Full of old knickknacks. Pa has it locked. There's an old Esterosin prayer book inside. The drawer is full of rocks. Mom, Dad. These crates are full of all kinds of ore. Yeah, Vaughn gave me his sword. Lin said it was his final wish. I don't know why he didn't give it to you instead. You deserve it more than I do. You! Don't tell me you're being hard on yourself again. I know it's been hard since he died, but he chose you to be sheriff for a reason, right, Oren? See? You work harder than anyone I know. So, just have a little more confidence, yeah? And when you're rich and famous, I'll just mooch off you. Kidding, obviously. Looks like a new wanted poster for questioning. Zagel. Wanted a line, John Moore, Watts, for treason. Hmm. 
I really don't like it at night. Just a few more things and then I'm getting some Keaton's Cobbler. Maybe Keaton wants the carrot cake? You know, it's been too long since we heard you sing. Why don't you grace us? Gosh, I don't know. Come, come, just one song? Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt. I'm not saying. Oh, okay, it's over. <clears throat> ah, this is embarrassing. I didn't even notice you were here. Well... Face, right. Did you at least enjoy it? No. Yeah, Santiago's probably just being nice, always asking me to sing. Well, it's always good to see you. I'm gonna get back to work. We have a good night, alright? You can always count on Keaton for a good meal. Have you seen Santiago the Bard? He's so dreamy. You, why do you trouble me? I have come to hunt bounties. See that your head never gains a price. The frontier has many problems, I hear. So many bounties. So many dangers. In the draw, we only worry about Ashford. Worry for the day they are foolish enough to come and take what remains ours. You northern folk. I like you better. More grounded. I cannot see you being so stupid. Ah, Sessa. You are the one Keaton has told me so much about. She's quite happy to have you back, you know. I've heard you so much of you, but you've been gone. It's like I've already known you. I'm Santiago, traveling bald of Zole. Here to spread joy and the light of life wherever I can, huh? You should come listen to my music. It will inspire your spear with a true fire. Have you heard? There are rev revante lurking about. Do not trust them, Sessa. Followers of the lying light. Fitting as they are all liars too. They act so devout and controlled, but I know how they are, Sessa. I have seen it. Revante are still the monsters they always were. Given the chance, they'll snuff out your light. Stay safe, Sessa. May Zole's fire protect you. How are you doing? Are you feeling up for some dinner? You gotta make sure you're eating enough. Mmm. Smoked salmon, extra vitality. There we go. Full heal and extra health bar. Just gotta figure out where I actually need to go. Your grandfather. He should not have died. Seeing you in pain. If I were to find the man who harmed him, the man who caused you this hurt, I could destroy him. Would that make you happy? Yes. I promise you, Orin, I will make his pain double what he has caused you. If I can do something to ease your burdens, do not be afraid to come to me. It is beginning to pain me to be without you. Why do you choose to fight with a pickaxe? Does that not pose a disadvantage to you? Alright, grab that.
Quite the day. I must hand it to the northern sky. No matter the weather, it's quite breathtaking. Eh. Alright, how do I combine the bits of stuff? Seems barred from the other side. I'll need a key in some way to reach behind the door. Rip, Sheriff Richard Vaughn, end of his line. Alright, already tried there. The crest, you have it. Pass it here and come on through. The Vaughn legacy thanks you. Oh, well, that was easier than I thought. It's locked. Finally dared to come for your blade. It's too late. I've broken it and scattered your sealed power. Now I can end things once and for all. Potion is a great investment. Looks like you beat me back to my senses. How long have I been lost? I'm Sir Oswin Vaughn. Patriarch of the Vaughn family and sworn enemy of the lifeless knight. You came to know it as Bolivar. He has cursed your family as well. You suffer because of my failure. Allow me to atone. Take my twisted lost soul. And if there is a way to use me against him, do not hesitate. Good luck with this burden. Finish what I started, I beg of you. Alright, now I just gotta find my way back to that colorless void. Thief, did you steal a soul for me? A tragedy in these colors. A family driven to madness. Three generations torn asunder by a single blade. And now that sword is back in its owner's hands. It seems you've completed what I've asked. I suppose I will allow you to understand, undertake my trial. How exciting. Though let me warn you, only one before you succeeded. The others, well, don't worry. Their colors were salvaged. I have opened one of the gates back the way you came. Best of luck. And don't worry. Your colors will be useful even if you die. Oh. Hmm.
Hmm. Smash that. Easy enough. Well, that didn't work. There we go. Alright, where do I want this? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, dang it. Okay, that's one of the ones that you can just stand on. Got it.
Hmm. Close. Whoop, dang it. Ah, dang it. Hey, Fragment of Heart or Vitality Up. How do I get there? If only I had some sort of way to cross small gaps. I see a library over there. Book stands out. Banishment. Will you read it? Yes. Armadale returned, and instead of punishing those mages, we were punished. We were cast into this lifeless prison, made for us to rotten. Time does not flow in this place, and it seems we are the only things that live here. Everything else is so frozen and dead. stands out. Mage Rebellion. The reason of why it happened may never be known to us, but the harmony between nations was shattered. The humans, led by mages, invaded our lands and slaughtered our people. We responded in kind. Suddenly our world was engulfed in bloodshed. Okay, not over there. book stands out. Path home. A way has been found. A number of us were sent through to test. The gates work and more. We have found access to worlds outside our own. Some hope we can find peace in those worlds. But I fear that this hunger for revenge against the mages has grown too strong. How do I get over to that one? Oh, just look down. We curse you, Armadel. Armadel, you lover of humans. You created us only as fodder for your true children. We served our purpose and now you send us here? We will be free. We will kill our creator. Oh, there's a giant arrow too. Man, they really wanted you to find that one. Hmm.
Most of that was red herring. Ready yourself, soldier. Beyond me is your greatest enemy. Well, I guess second greatest now. I've heard the story. Hey, loser. Still pretending, huh? So obvious when you're lying. You aren't some savior. I'd know. We are me, after all, right? Come on, crybaby. Admit it. We're just the same old scum. There we are. See? Easier to just admit it. Listen, we only came back because we ran out of money, right? That wasn't so hard now, was it? You miss it. Admit it. You want to go back south. Yeah, right. We love it. It was so much easier down there. Wait, do we actually care about these people? Phew, had me worried. Come on. When all this is over, we're just leaving again, right? Like hell. It's still all about us, though, right? Don't tell me. Are we trying to be moral? Poor Pa is looking down on us with shame. Ha ha ha. Who cares? You hate us, don't you? Who we were. Are we really different now? The internal struggle continues. No matter what you do, how much better you become, you know, I will never go away. I'll always be waiting for that moment of weakness to take over again. Just give up. We will just struggle forever. Ugh, what a pain. Just stop. All this pointless struggle. Listen. Loser. Time's almost up already. Just give up. You are so irritating. Get out of our head. So what? Do we want to live with these losers for the rest of our lives? Seriously? But it's so cold here. We still don't feel bad, right? For what we did? We did right by us and there's nothing wrong with that, right? Right on the money. This will never end. Ugh, listen. We kill Bolivar and then we leave. Deal? Why? What else is possibly worth being here? We aren't in love, are we? Don't scare me like that. Jeez. Well, well. Looks like you're out of time. Any last hope resistance before we take over again? You're annoying. We're never coming back this time. Easy times forever. No. 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 I'll be waiting. Well done. Why don't you come see me? Color me impressed. You've improved. I suppose I can fix your colors. You will no longer be the tragic minor boy. I'm counting on you. Go now. Avenge your grandfather. You carry his colors now. I'll be watching. Right now. All right. Well, now that I have colors, I guess I go into the lighthouse. <laughs> well done. Do you have anyone to say goodbye to? Let's sort that out before finding Bolivar in there. Hard to know what could happen. Time to prove yourself and end this. Sisa! Prevada na ora de ma. There's something different about you. You blame me, eh? You had the time to be with him. But you threw it away. Wasted it. I simply picked it up. You had many years to be with him. To save him. Think on it. He wouldn't have taken me in if had you not been gone. But denial is easier, eh? Huh? Don't worry. Dying is even easier. Seek my brother, seek my brother, okay. An old journal. What limits does a god have? What power could this sword bring him? Would he become like the creature within my nightmares? Raim, where are you? My god, why must I face this alone? Sir Oswin Vaughan. A bloodstained journal. It appears my time is up. I suppose it was always fate to die writing in these damn books. I gave up everything for this. My home, my wife, all for what? A lighthouse filled with ramblings? How pitiful. We are no closer to ending this. I still hear the souls. They're angry, sad, so many emotions. And where is my god? Has Rain truly abandoned me? No, 
I don't think she was ever truly with me. Now, I go into the lifeless night, forever. I will find you, and fight you directly. Sir Oswin Vaughn. An old journal. Things are strange here. Perhaps I'm going mad. This time in the lighthouse, it feels like I am no longer in Van's point. I hear the souls cry out to me, begging for freedom. Graham, forgive me. I cannot save you yet. Sir Oswin Vaughn. Although we've removed the souls from the blade, they still linger. It's as if they're chained to this accursed blade. Do they not wish to be free? Can okay, they not escape? I wish I knew the answers. The Akanai people will join me, and tonight we shall steal the blade away, to prevent him from finding it before we can free these souls. I fear what could happen if he were to find it. This blade seems so close to breaking. It would not take much for him now. An old journal. The the Akanai are a haunting, yet incredible people. Somehow, they managed to determine the curse on its strength. This mortal god. He may be using these souls to break the seal on his power. Raim only knows how many poor souls are now locked in this blade. We plan to free them, though I pray I do not die before my work is done. So many years have been lost. I had forgotten how old I'd become. Sir Oswin Vaughn. This prayer book has seen a lot of use. It's got a note written on the first page. You are so talented, gifted, and able. I know great things will come of you. No matter your path, I will always be proud of you. I love you, son. Sir Oswin Vaughn. Whoops. Well, I'm gonna have to reset. Okay, that's just that over there. All right, I think everything is set up properly. Estorosa is a, the land of a single god. However, in older records, I have found evidence that they once served two gods. Now they worship a single god of stars and life, while warning of the dark and lifeless night. This evidence points to the possibility that this lack of life is its own god. At some point, something changed. Yeah, I already read all those books, thank you. This god of the Estorosans betrayed his brother and stole his power. This damned him to mortality and sealed his power into a sacred object. To think, all that to save Estorosa from a lifeless night. I can't read this. What are all these symbols? An old journal. My nightmares are getting worse. A creature among the blackness of the sky, with only one eye. 
It watches me as I die time and time again. I fear my study of dark gods is haunting me. Is this my punishment? I've begun to make contact with experts in magic. Together, we will see what I can do about destroying this power for good. An old journal. This sacred object is a sword. Its power is sealed with hundreds of souls. Within this blade, I believe, lingers the power of a dark, forgotten god. This power. It is waiting to be released. Okay. Where to start? Mm, probably here. Get rid of that. Move you out of the way. Get you out of the way. Perfect. Hmm. Okay, need to hit the switch again. I locked him in, Bolivar. I heard what you have done for our people. May this ever, even the debt, be brave, Orin. A new light in your eye. Maybe you could stop me, huh? No, no, I'm kidding. It's hopeless. I will be whole soon enough. my charge attack. You are too late. I am nearly whole again. It's hopeless. Come on then, Sissa. Alright, I think I'm going to go back and heal. Alright, the one on the left is fast travel to the end point. Surprised to see me outside? Coming out and look out across the sea. Makes me wonder about all that's out there. Adventurers come through here all the time. They're all living excited lives. Some part of me wonders if I'm missing out. Is it everything you'd hoped it'd be? No. That's disappointing to hear. But I guess at the end, all that doesn't really matter. I mean, I love it here, really. And hey, you came back. Must mean there's something special about this place, right? Gosh, when you left, it was like my whole childhood left with you. You didn't even say goodbye, Warren. But that's in the past now. You're back and that's what matters. I should be heading back now. Can't imagine the trouble they're getting into in there. Thanks for listening. Come talk to me again soon, alright?
player buffs. Smoke salmon. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna need hole protection anymore. Because I think it's just the boss fight now. You have changed, but I feel my curse is broken. Humans are fading stars, hopelessly shining against my Noel. Our dance ends here, Sessa. Proud of you. What is this garbage? Their hopes can't do anything. You are all alone. Alright, so it's just dodge until cutscene lets me attack him. Isn't over, Sessa. Complete all the complete the game within thirty days, all in a month's work. Setting moon, complete act two. The sun may rise, but it will always fall. Night always returns. We will meet again, Sessa. be proud. All of them would. Heck, I am. You've proved me wrong. You really are a northerner. Listen, Horan, you need anything, you let me know. Alright, well, that was prodigal. Would you like to save your game? Yeah. All right. 